Meanwhile, Tourism Secretary Ramon Jimenez sees the recovery of Zabuanga City from the destruction of armed conflict. For the details of this report, here's Freddy Abando. Mindanao's promise as a major nation is endless. There is so much promise to be discovered by Filipinos and foreigners. Sambuanga City is one of the emerging places to relish its rich culture and history. It is called the City of Flowers because of the flower gardens that line up its major thoroughfares. It has all the charms, most especially its people, which captivates tourists to visit. But for nearly two weeks now, the city has been under siege by Manila forces. It is a minor setback for the city and other areas of Mindanao to include the island provinces of the arm. As the situation in the city normalizes, the tourists will return. Proof is the resumption of flights from Manila to Zamboanga City. Tourism Secretary Ramon Jimenez is bullish Zamboanga City and the rest of Mindanao will recover. The challenge for uh, Zamboanga in particular is, shall we say, uh, w would appear to be steeper. Mm. But its tremendous advantage is that Zamboanga is drop-dead gorgeous yeah. as a place. Yes, sir. So I have every confidence that uh, they will recover, especially the determination of, uh, you know, Mayor Klimako uh, to uh, and uh, everybody, Congressman uh, Lobregat, everybody, uh, including the president, is determined to help them. Now, uh, for total Mindanao, I think Mindanao is fairly well insulated now from mm -hmm. from uh, occurrences such as that. And in fact, we are working to make sure that that, that is even more the case because Mindanao uh, should have and will have its own marketing program mm -hmm. to, uh, to insulate it from that. There were plenty of destinations to be discovered for the autonomous region, Lake Lano in Marawi City. It is a lake that can match the beauty of world-class tourist destinations in Europe. Sulu Congressman Tupai Luong Baird, the beaches of his province, can rival or even beat what Boracay and other world-rated beaches can offer. So with Tawi Tawi, which has the Turtle Islands, destinations close to Malaysia, Indonesia, Brunei, and Singapore. They are, they are great destinations, and like all great destinations, they have to begin as successful domestic uh, destinations, which is something I agreed with Congressman Long, uh, we should work on. Mm. Let's start by, uh, for example, by making Sulu a popular domestic destination to identify the key markets, the types of people who would like to go to Sulu, you know, and work on those. When you ask them now, who goes to Sulu, they have no answer. We've got to have an answer there now and uh, we've got to identify who has the highest propensity to, uh, to uh, accept an invitation to go there. For the People's Television Network, this is Freddie Abanda reporting.